First of all, you don't have a bottle here. No, How can you be providing health care without water? They just do it and say the last. What about those things there? What are they? Are people living there? So who owns who supervising this property? Who has responsibility for it? It's council. It's council. We handed over to the council. Can I have a report on the facility you have here? Okay. You people behave as if government has done, done nothing. Look at There's a facility here. It's not being used. Huh? So what is the responsibility of council? Just to play politics. Huh? No, sir. Look, these are the things we are going to measure you on. This place has to be functional. Do you understand? I need it cleaned, painted, and repaired. There must be a borehole here. How can you have a health center without water? I'm giving you three months. This plane will turn around here. Do you understand? Yes. If you are making excuses, then who will fix it? I'm not making excuses. You are telling me this is what happened? No, we have heard you. We have heard you. Give, I give you 90 days. If this place doesn't work, you seem to be the local government chairman. But there's no purpose. You're not, you're not adding value to the people. Calling for why, why must it be intervention all the time? It, of yes. course, government has intervened all the years. I mean, they make it seem as if nothing happened. But when people can't just add a bit more value to what government has created, this is what happens. So the issue is not intervention of what government has done or not done. It's what let's ask those people who have the responsibility to provide services. Well, let's ask them begin to interrogate and question them. I mean, there's no so much. How much more can government do? So what's, what's yeah. your word for the local government leadership right The now? local government leadership have to sit up. If we do not provide services for our people, then they, there's no justification for their existence. <laughs>